What is up? It's your boy in here bringing to you guys a brand new freaking video, man. So look, listen, today, today we got a fun one. Today we got an exciting one. Today we got a banger. So in today's video, we're going to be talking about two things. One, am I really selling the Tacoma? And two, do modifications bring down the value on your truck? As you guys already know, 2021 Toyota Tacoma SR5, four wheel drive, and it is done up. Cue the montage. <laughs> So first and foremost, let me know, do you think that all of these modifications, one, increase the value or two, brought it down. I know a lot of people when I was doing these were like, ha, good luck trying to resell. You will never get rid of the truck. I hope you like it because you'll never ever have someone to buy it from you. I was very happy with that. I didn't mind. The curiosity got the best of me. So I took some pictures and I actually only sent it to one place because I was like, what if I send it out to somebody and they're a fan of the channel and they're like, why are you sending this to me? And I sent it out to one place, the one place that bought my last truck for more than anybody else wanted to. Um, they, they made an offer on this truck. Um, so uh, let's get into it. So they did have some questions. I will admit most of the time it all went through email. Like my last truck, it all went through email. This time, I kid you not, he literally calls me and he's like, I see your truck. I like your truck. Are you serious about selling it? Me being me, I tell him, look buddy, listen, okay? There's a price on everything. You give me a good price, and the truck might be yours. I hope the Tacoma isn't listening. So he's like, all right, let me look at this truck a little bit further. I'll send it over to the guy who does the appraisals and I'll get back to you. So he ends up getting back to me later in the day, not with the price, not with anything. He just starts texting me like, hey, what's, what's up with the truck? Why is one side black? Why is one side chrome? I go on and explain. I have no life. And I think I'm creative, so I did that. He asked me if I bought chrome wheels and then spray painted them black. I bought them like that from Procom. He asked me a question I don't really know why this question came up but you let me know he asked me if i'm still paying on the wheels i don't know if that's a thing that's what he asked me though i have no idea what uh what exactly that means to the same company i asked him give me a quote what do you guys think you guys can give me for a stock sr5 completely stock i sent them the pictures did everything they offered me 37,000 for the truck fast forward to all the modifications being done lifted different headlights leds all the way around grill everything done up as it sits they offered me wait for it thirty four thousand dollars thirty four thousand so instead of increasing the value i spent more money on the truck and lost value i was just kidding i'm just trolling they offered me forty three thousand dollars for this truck as it sits so purchased it for 37 out the door spent a little over i think three thousand dollars four thousand dollars modding it <laughs> And we're at four thousand dollars now 37 to 43 that's six thousand so profit okay profit loosely because these gas prices they've eaten up the profit two thousand dollars if you're normal and you have a trd off-road and you lift it put bigger tires on it do cool things to it i reckon that you'll make more money on it but you also have to take into account what you're buying had i bought some crazy stealth wheels bought like a king suspension then it it wouldn't it wouldn't benefit selling it then it would hurt but if you do it right you can profit some money black side chrome side all the way around it is customized to my liking and there is someone willing to pay more than what i paid for this vehicle so now let's talk about the burning question am i really gonna sell the tacoma listen buddy this is a beast of a truck this thing is done up one of one specifically to my liking it's an sr5 I like that. It doesn't have too much gadgets. It doesn't have too much gizmos. I like that. The wheels and tires, I like them. The lift, I like it. The upper control arms, I like it. But I am willing to sell it. I am 100% willing to sell it. I don't know if I should. In a year, maybe a year and a half, there's going to be a new generation Tacoma that comes out. Should I sell it now, right now that someone's willing to offer me more than I paid for it, get a TRD Pro, because I know a Pro is going to hold its value way more than a three-year-old SR5 at that time. So if I get a TRD Pro, keep it stock, maybe change out some tires, keep it for a little while until the next generation comes out. Or I can keep this truck, pay it off before the next gen comes out, and then get a next gen. I don't really know what to do. Everyone can agree. Getting a new truck is always exciting. Like The fact that I could sell this truck in profit, 2000 is fun. Is it worth it? 
I don't know. You can't even cover market adjustment with 2K. I don't know. Let me know down below in the comment section. What do you guys think? Do I get rid of Big Blue? I'm very intrigued to know what you guys think. I don't know how the market is around you guys, but around me, it's awful. I found a couple SRs with $7,000 market adjustment. I found another dealership that's doing no market adjustment, but they are like completely sold out. I found another one that's doing no market adjustment. First come, first serve but they'd have like no Tacomas. So with all that being said, I hope you guys did enjoy. Please leave a like, please leave a comment, please leave a subscription. We're so close to a million subscribers and I'm thankful that you're helping me get there. This truck is a beast and I haven't even done anything to it. Like I've been in a little bit of a building phase. I wanted to go everywhere with this truck. I wanted to drive it to the mountains, do a bunch of stuff, but I haven't gotten the chance. Now that I'm about to get the chance, the offer has come up to sell it. What do you guys think? With all that being said, I hope you guys did enjoy. It's been your boy. I'm out like an Audi. I'll see you tomorrow. Cinco de Malo. Peace.